Number 10. The OII Urban Driverless Transportation System is advanced. The conceptual OI Urban Driverless Transportation System has been designed by the 2050. Lab as an interchangeable autonomous vehicle solution for use in cityscapes in the near future. The autonomous vehicle system utilizes a single platform with support for an array of different pod like units. These could be used to carry passengers, deliver packages, or even collect materials for recycling. The robotic vehicle would seamlessly yet safely navigate city streets to reduce traffic and keep environments focused on citizens. The conceptual OI urban driverless transportation system would accommodate increased efficiency by ensuring the vehicle is always in use and never sitting empty thanks to the aforementioned pods. This could also work to reduce the need for large fleets of purpose-built vehicles in favor of a more flexible alternative. Number 9. A team of designers created a futuristic hydrogen bike concept. A team of experienced designers created a conceptual hydrogen-powered bike concept titled the Hydra Bike. The Hydra was designed by Anton Guzhov, Anton Brousseau, and Andre Tailforth. The concept bike was unveiled in a teaser trailer uploaded to Tailforth's YouTube channel, where it has since accrued thousands of views for its innovative design that blends function with eco-consciousness. The Hydra features a drivetrain that runs on hydrogen fuel cells. These fuel cells are charged through only two products, heat and water, which results in a zero emissions, eco-friendly transportation method that, on paper, rivals the performance of electric motorcycles. The Hydra boasts a clear frame that displays the hydrogen tubing under it, allowing viewers to see how the conceptual hydrogen engine would work in practice. Number 8 The all-electric ether luxury airship by Mack Byers could usher in a new era of air travel. The Ether Luxury Airship concept is the final year university project by Mac Byers for his Transport Design BA, Hans, at the University of Huddersfield. A luxury cruise concept based upon an airship platform, the Ether allows passengers to travel at high speeds in luxury and provides them with some of the most breathtaking views available. The airship is based on the technology currently being developed by Aeroscraft. For the exterior design, Byers studied things like Thunderbird 2, Star Wars, and the NASA Space Shuttle, things that appeal to the young adult generation, the generation that may someday be the target market for the Ether. Wanting to communicate the green credentials of the all-electric Ether, Byers used clean colors like white and formed the main balloon into an aerodynamic and wing-like shape. This also visually communicates that this is a new type of airship. One that is safer and cleaner than airships like the Hindenburg of the 20th century. Number 7 Yes, the Von Braun Space Hotel idea is wild. But could we build it by 2025? How possible is the Von Braun Rotating Space Station? Will you be planning a trip to an orbiting space hotel as early as 2025? The Gateway Foundation, a private company developing this space hotel, thinks so. The organization plans to build what it describes on its website as the first spaceport. This spaceport, the Von Braun Rotating Space Station, will orbit Earth and will accommodate not only scientific research, opens a new tab, but also visiting tourists looking to experience life away from our home planet, opens a new tab. But, while any timeline for the creation of such a structure would be daunting, the Gateway Foundation plans to build the spaceport, opens a new tab, as early as 2025, with the support of the space construction company Orbital Assembly. According to Timothy Alatori, 
the lead architect of this space station, who also works as the treasurer and an executive team member at the Gateway Foundation, the Von Braun Station is designed to be the largest human-made structure in space and will house up to 450 people. Alatory is also designing the interiors of the station, including the habitable spaces and gymnasium. Number 6. All about the Hyundai walking car concept. Hyundai's walking car Elevate was first revealed at CES 2019 as a smart mobility solution for traversing tough terrains. The concept car uses four robotic legs to climb and walk, opening up various real-life applications. The concept made headlines again in February 2021 when Hyundai revealed a walking robot, Tiger X1. This shows Hyundai's dedication to make the concept a reality. It is even expected that beta prototypes will be ready for testing as early as 2023. Let's explore some of the concept's design features and applications. The design. A car with robotic legs may seem hypothetical at first, but with current progress, we can expect a working prototype very soon. It all began with Hyundai Walking Car Elevate, as the company wishes to explore vehicular mobility. The project Elevate goes beyond standard vehicles on wheels as it can walk, climb, and traverse terrains. Number 5. Equilius like Yamaha and Ducati are actively developing electric motorcycles as well, but here we have a very interesting concept from a designer from Taiwan. It is a patrol motorcycle ideal for work in forests, mountains, and other areas where getting by car is impossible and ATVs are too slow. The main feature is the easy-to-carry removable units for storing equipment. There are five of them. With a total capacity of 45 gallons, the design is also interesting. It looks futuristic and rough, but the author is sure that the bike will be comfortable to ride even on the ground. This is what we know about its characteristics of 40 horsepower engine up to 186 miles of range color display instead of a dashboard and support for wireless charging technology. Number 4. Groundbreaking 40M Zero Emission Trimaran Concept Domus Unveiled Rob Doyle Design and Van Geese Design have collaborated to present Domus, a 40-meter sailing trimaran with interior volume that rivals a 60-meter motor yacht. With speed, space, and eco-conscious cruising at the forefront of the design, Domus aims to become to the first truly zero-emission yacht over 750 gross tons. The uniquely designed combination of solar power, hydro regeneration technology, and hydrogen fuel cells gives Domus unlimited range with zero emissions, the design team said. An optimized system of solar power and battery storage allows the yacht to motor during daylight hours and then transfer over to the battery system at night. This also means that Domus is fully silent with zero emissions while at anchor. Alongside veritable eco-credentials, Domus has been designed with performance in mind. To reduce drag and improve speeds, it will be able to heal at an angle of 2 degrees. This will also ensure a comfortable cruise with minimal rolling. Number 3 Space Perspective unveils capsule design for Spaceship Neptune. Edinburgh, July 29, 2022. Florida-based company, Space Perspective, unveiled the design of its pressurized, balloon-borne capsule, Spaceship Neptune, which will become operational in about two years from now. The carbon-neutral spaceship will comprise the space balloon, reserve descent system, and the Neptune capsule. The capsule will be spherical, accessible, sustainable, and safe. 
It was developed to remain secured to the space balloon for the whole duration of the flight. Its shape and windows allow for panoramic views. The capsule will have a splash cone at its bottom for softer ocean landings. Spaceship Neptune will be lifted to space slowly at 19 km per hour by the company's renewable hydrogen-propelled space balloon. Anyone medically fit to fly with a commercial airline will be able to fly aboard Spaceship Neptune. The six-hour flights will reach altitudes of about 30 km. The capsule will be able to carry eight passengers and a pilot for the price of US $125,000. Commercial flights are planned to start in late 2024. Number 2. Hyundai Motor Preview's HDC6 Neptune concept and trailer. HDC6 Neptune captures Hyundai Motors' vision for zero-carbon emission fuel cell electric truck technology and design. Hyundai Translate's HT Nitro Thermotech Registered presents a more sustainable green energy refrigerated concept trailer. The HDC6 Neptune concept is set to debut at the North American Commercial Vehicle Show. Hyundai Motor Company, HMC revealed today the first rendering images of its concept for a hydrogen-powered fuel cell electric truck, HDC-6 Neptune. Known for its leadership in fuel cell technology with integrated capabilities for the passenger and commercial vehicle markets, HMC will debut its latest commercial truck concept during this year's North American Commercial Vehicle Show in Atlanta. In addition, Hyundai Trans Lead, HT, will also reveal its eco-friendly, high-performance refrigerated concept trailer solution, HT Nitro Thermotech Registered. The joint press conference will take place on October 29th at the Georgia World Congress Center in Atlanta, Georgia. Supporting the company's vision for a zero-carbon emission fuel cell truck, Hyundai's name for its concept HDC6 Neptune, recognizes the Roman god of the seas, Neptune, symbolizing the hydrogen-powered natural elements of the sea, the largest potential source of hydrogen fuel on Earth. Number 1. Wurzela presents its visions of future shipping. Wurzela has set out its visions for the future of the shipping industry. The work on future visions has been prompted by the inevitable effect that growing global energy demand and increasingly stringent environmental legislation to combat climate change will have on the shipping sector. Additionally, Wurzela assesses various emerging trends, such as sharing economies, new business models enabled by the new digital universe, the huge growth in energy storage capacity, and new affordable green energy sources, since they represent both challenges and opportunities for the future of shipping. We accept the challenges created by the developments currently taking place. Wurzela is increasing its speed of reinvention, not just internally but in cooperation with our customers and partners so that the industry can be assured of having the technologies ready and available to meet the new requirements, says Roger Holm, President, Wurzela Marine Solutions. In its Visions of Future Shipping paper, Wurzela presents different scenarios that could shape the way that shipping companies operate in the future. These scenarios have each been identified under different names as follows. 